Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger! Today's episode, Cliffhanger and the Bed. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly below him, Cliff sees two movers carrying a large Ed. An Ed? What is an Ed? Deftly, Cliff delves into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. Earache, easel, here it is, Ed. When you see an Ed, find the letter B, then drop it. Ed, bed. I get it, it's a bed. As intrepid cliffhanger made his escape at last, this is as easy as falling out of bed. Uh-oh. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Can't hold on much longer! Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of... Cliffhanger! Today's adventure number 30, Cliffhanger and the Dirty Purple Shirt. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff! And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Excuse me! Excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last. Hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, below him, Cliff sees a very big ape carrying a huge basket of dirty laundry. Hurriedly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you see a very big ape carrying a huge basket of dirty laundry, curl up inside a very big dirty shirt and hurl yourself into the basket. Perfect. Has Cliffhanger's luck finally turned? Is he at last on the verge of escaping from his cliff? Now? Oh. Mercy, this jerky looking shirt isn't mine. <laughs> I'm cursed. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Can't hold on much longer! Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing, daring, and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number 2612, Cliffhanger and the Wish Upon a Star. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff! And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Excuse me! Excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer! Suddenly, night falls. Far, far above, the first star appears. Sharp as attack, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. When you see a star, make a wish. Starlight, star bright, first star I see tonight, get me off this cliff. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff. Excuse me. 
Would you folks mind rescuing me? Can all be well thanks to Clip's wistful wish? That's easy for you to say. No! It is only a dream. A dream? And that's why he's called Cliff Hanger! Can't hold on much longer! Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of... Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number 2712, Cliffhanger and the Yodeling Yellow Yak. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't. Hold on much longer. Suddenly, far below him, Cliff overhears two scientists yakking. I yearn to find a yodeling yellow yak. Me too. Quickly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and yanks out his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you hear two scientists yakking about a yodeling yellow yak, put on a yellow yak costume and start yodeling. Why didn't I think of that? Yes. Yodeling. Yikes, that's a yodeling yak. Yes, let's yank him off the cliff and bring him home with us. Are Cliff's years of hanging from a cliff about to come to an end? No, we must leave this magnificent creature here, where Mother Nature meant for him to be. You're right, of course. The yak stays here. I'm not really a yak. And that's why he's called Cliff Hanger. Can hold on much longer flying off the shelf once again it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of cliffhanger today's adventure episode 39 happy birthday cliffhanger cliffhanger hanging from a cliff and that's why he's called cliffhanger Excuse me! Excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. As today's episode begins, Cliff looks at his calendar watch and discovers... <gasps> it's my birthday! But I'm afraid no one will remember. We remember? And we've brought you... This scrumptious birthday cake! This is remarkable! Make a wish and blow out the candles! If you blow them all out, your wish will be granted! Even without consulting his trusty survival manual, Cliffhanger knows just what to do! My wish is that you will rescue me from this cliff! <sighs> Oh, too bad. Don't worry! Even if you had blown them all out, we're too far away now to rescue you anyway! Happy, Happy birthday! birthday! Rats. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Can't hold on much longer! Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of... Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, episode number seven, Cliffhanger celebrates Kiss a Moose Week. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff notices two moose standing on a high wooden platform nearby. A banner above them reads, 
Kiss me, I'm a moose. In a flash, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his impressive decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you see two moose standing on a nearby platform, ask them to help you. Say, will you please get me off this cliff? No can do until we finish our job as official cheerleaders of National kiss -a moose Week. But after that, your wish is our command. I have to wait a whole week? It's only seven days. And day one starts now. My fellow moose, what day is it? Sunday of kiss -a moose Week. What's that mean? We get kissed. <laughs> the next morning... And what day is it now? Monday! <laughs> and so it goes through Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and finally, Saturday. Well, that's it for Kiss a Moose Week. <sighs> now that your celebration is finally over, will you please get me off this cliff? Well, as I said last Sunday, your wish is our command. And that's why he's called Cliff Hanger. Can't hold on much longer. Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of Cliff Hanger. Today's adventure number 7657. Cliffhanger and Quentin Quigley's quick question. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me. Excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last. Hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff sees a blimp with question marks on it approaching his cliff. Excuse me, sir. I'm Quentin Quigley. And you are on my popular quiz program, Off This Cliff, the show that could get you off this cliff. Do you want to answer a quick question? Quickly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If Quentin quickly asks you if you want to answer a quick question, say yes. Yes. Okay, here goes. True or false, Mr. Hanger? Are you going to get off this cliff today? True. I am going to get off this cliff today. True. Oh, I'm terribly sorry, Mr. Hanger, but the correct answer is false. Better luck next time playing Off This Cliff! And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Can't hold on much longer. Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number 7,616, Cliffhanger and the Awfully Big Seesaw. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't. Hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff notices an enormous seesaw on the lawn below his cliff. Gee, that's an awfully big seesaw. Quickly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and withdraws his trusty survival manual. Using his awe-inspiring decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you see an awfully big seesaw on the lawn below your cliff, jump on.
Is a new life dawning for Cliffhanger? A life beyond his cliff? Awesome! Seesaw! Aw, oh, shucks. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Can't hold on much longer! Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of... Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, Chapter 12,363, Cliffhanger and the Chuckling Chickens. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't. Hold on much longer. By chance, Cliff looks up and spots a bunch of chuckling chickens clutching a chain with a chair on the end of it. Quickly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his champion decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you spot a bunch of chuckling chickens clutching a chain with a chair on the end of it, ask them to get you down. Get me down! Uh, what does down mean? I'll look it up in my trusty chicken dictionary. Down, the soft feathers of young birds often used to make pillows. <laughs> But down has another meaning, too. It's the opposite of up. <laughs> Enjoy your down. And you can keep the chain. <laughs> and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Can't hold on much longer. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me! Excuse me! Today's adventure, episode 16, Cliffhanger and the Crane. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff notices that a big construction project has started up in the valley below. Wow! Maybe they're building a skyscraper so tall, I'll be able to jump onto the roof and ride the elevator down to freedom. Say, fellas, you aren't by any chance building a tall skyscraper, are you? Afraid not, pal. But uh, let me know if there's anything else my crew could help you with. Hmm, let me consult my survival manual. Using his amazing decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If a construction crew offers to help you, ask them to use their machines to get you off your cliff. Say, guys, can you use your machines to get me off this cliff? Well, I'm not sure the dump truck or the steam shovel will be much help. But this crane here with the electric-powered magnetic lifter, it's got some promise. Maybe the magnetic lifter can only lift metal objects, and I'm not sure it can reach high enough, but we can try. Don't worry about the metal objects. I just happen to have this large iron anvil here in my backpack. Well, all right then. Let's give it a go. Much longer. Hang off the shelf once again. It's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger. Today's adventure: Cliffhanger and the Fuzzy Wuzzy Bear and the Big Wig. 
Excuse me! Excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff sees a fuzzy wuzzy bear. Fuzzy wuzzy wuzzy! Fuzzy wuzzy wuzzy! Hurriedly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. When you see a fuzzy wuzzy bear, ask him to let down his hair. Fuzzy wuzzy bear, let down your hair. Joy infuses the breast of the intrepid adventurer. At last, he is saved. It was just a big wig. Oh, nuts. Fuzzy Wuzzy wasn't fuzzy, was he? I am a baldy waldy! <laughs> and that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Can't hold on much longer! Flying off the shelf once again! It's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, episode 892, Cliffhanger and the Grumpy Guard Gatherers. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't. Hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff spots two grumpy guard gatherers. <laughs> That's too small. That's minuscule. Cliff gropes around in his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his noted decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you spot two gourd gatherers gathering gourds, Disguise yourself as a gourd and get gathered. Luckily, I have a gorgeous gourd costume. I just hope it's big enough. That gourd is gargantuan. Yes, it's much too big. It's ridiculously huge. No! And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Can't. Hold on much longer. Flying off the shelf once again. It's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger. Today's adventure, Cliffhanger and the Judge of Jam Jar Jugglers. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me! Excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff spots a famous judge of Jam Jar Jugglers. Stop the Jeep, Jeeps! Hey! I'm a famous judge of jam jar jugglers. Want to try juggling some jam jars? Cliff reaches into his backpack, extracts his trusty survival manual, and begins to read. If a judge of jam jar jugglers asks you to juggle jam jars, then juggle. I'll try it. Okay, kid. If you're good enough, there's a part for you in the next Def Jam Jar Juggling movie. Best one-armed juggling act I ever saw. But sadly, the juggler in this movie has to juggle with two arms. Jeeps! Wait! Jeepers! And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Can't hold on much longer! Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of Cliff!
Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number 3,787. Cliffhanger and the Mammoth Whale. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me! Excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, in the water below, he catches sight of a mammoth whale. A whale? Cliff grabs his trusty survival manual from his backpack and using his expert decoding skills, begins to read. If you catch sight of a whale and it blasts water from its blowhole, jump on the blast fast. Whoa, what a blast! I'm free at last! Is this it? Has Cliffhanger's life of grasping a branch passed at last? No! Another blast from the whale sends Cliff back past his branch! This is a blast! Dread! And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Can't hold on much longer! Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing, daring, and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number one million and one, Cliffhanger and the Marching Band. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Excuse me, excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff hears a marching band on the cliff above him. Quickly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his miraculous decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If a marching band shows up, ask if you can join them. May I join your marching band? Maybe, but we'll need to hear you play first. Uh, give me a moment to find the right instrument. A tuba. Perfect. <laughs> That was magnificent! Unfortunately, uh, we have far too many tuba players already. Oh. Well, at least could you give me a hand? Boys, let's give this marvelous tuba player a hand. Can't hold on much longer. Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing, daring, and dangling adventures of... Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number 919, Cliffhanger and the Nightingales. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Cliff notices that night is falling. Quickly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his nifty survival manual. Using his notable decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you notice that night is falling, disguise yourself as a baby nightingale in distress, Nito. Help! I'm in distress! Oh, look! A baby nightingale in distress! We'll take him to our nest and raise him as our own. Will these nurturing nightingales be Cliff's route to a new, non-cliffhanging existence? Eat your night crawlers, dear. They're good for you. And now it's time for our new baby to fly for the first time.
Okay, family, nudge him out of the nest. No, no, you don't understand. I'm not really a nightingale. Nuts. And that's why he's called Drift Hanger. Can't hold on much longer. Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing, daring, and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number six, Cliffhanger and Trixie the Tricky Pixie. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Suddenly, above him, Cliff sees Trixie the Tricky Pixie. Quickly, Cliff digs into his nifty backpack and lifts out his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. Ricky the Tick Picker, here it is, Trixie the Tricky Pixie. When you see Trixie the Tricky Pixie, say the magic words and she will give you a lift off the cliff. The magic words? That would be six thick thistle sticks. Six sit thistle thicks. Nope. Uh, six sick thistle sticks. Uh-uh. 606 minutes pass. Six thick thistle sticks. Sorry, your time is up. I have got to get to a picnic in Dixie. Six thick thistle sticks. Six thick thistle sticks. Six thick thistle sticks. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Can't hold on, Lutch Monger. No. Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger. Today's adventure, episode number 5,711, Cliffhanger and the Very Powerful Vacuum Cleaner. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't. Hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff hears voices high above him on the cliff. Hi, I'm a vacuum cleaner vendor. And I'm a vegetable gatherer. And I'm here to sell you this very, very, very powerful vacuum cleaner. But why would a vegetable gatherer like me want a very, very, very powerful vacuum cleaner? because it can vacuum up every vegetable in view. That's why, watch this. Cliff reaches into his backpack and removes his very valuable survival manual. Using his vaunted decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you see a vacuum cleaner vendor vending a very, very, very powerful vacuum cleaner, Move under the hose and get vacuumed off the cliff. All I have to do is press this violet colored button here and... Nothing ventured, nothing gained. <laughs> Voila! That was very impressive. But how do I get all the vegetables out of the vacuum? No problema. You simply point the vacuum cleaner hose up in the air and push this vermilion colored button here. And that's why you call Cliffhanger. Can. Hold on much longer. It's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger. Today's adventure, number 76, 
Cliffhanger and the Enchanted Goat in a Coat in a Boat. Cliffhanger hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. All of a sudden, Cliff spots an enchanted goat in a coat, floating in a boat. Cliff reaches in his backpack and locates his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. When you see an enchanted goat in a coat, floating in a boat, give her some toast and say, Please get me off this cliff. Please get me off this cliff. Get you off this cliff? My pleasure. Are Cliffhanger's days on the cliff finally over? Will he now be able to roam free forever? I hope he likes this cliff better than the other one. <laughs> And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Can't hold on much longer. <sighs> oh, you're right, Lionel. Mm -hmm. This is an amazing book. <sighs> no, it's not. It's like all the other Cliffhanger books. No, it isn't, Leona. Well, your brother's right. Today's adventure, Adventure 77, Cliffhanger and the Giant Snail. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff hears a voice calling to him. Hello, Cliffhanger! I am here to help you! Where are you? Up here! I am a giant African snail. I am not big enough to lift you off the cliff, but I will fetch someone who can! That's amazing! Please hurry! All righty, here I go! Through autumn, winter, spring, and summer, the giant snail makes his way to fetch Cliffhanger's rescuers. He must be there by now. Whoa, you've only gone seven feet? And your point is? My point is that I can't hold on much longer! Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of... Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number 1826, Cliffhanger and the Kindly Kangaroo King. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff spots a king dangling a huge hook. Quickly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you spot a king dangling a huge hook, ask him to rescue you. What a keen idea. Say, your majesty, would you mind using your hook to pull me up to safety? It would please us greatly to serve you in this manner. Will this kindly king be the key to Cliffhanger's escape? Thanks. Your highness, I can't help but notice that you are a kangaroo. Yes, we are a kangaroo. Now 
sadly, it's time for us to part to Lou Cliff. off the shelf once again, it's the continuing, daring, and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number 2,498, Cliffhanger and the Rain. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last. Hanging from a cliff? Can't hold on much longer. When suddenly it begins to rain, and rain, and rain. Cliff strains to reach into his backpack, and soon obtains his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. Hmm. Brain? Grain? Ah, here we are. Rain. If it rains and rains and rains, don't complain. Jump into the water. I can't complain. Is this it? Has Cliffhanger finally gained his freedom? Oops. Look! A chain! A dream! And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Can't hold on much longer! Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of... Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number 6,767, Cliffhanger and the Sheep on a Ship. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, sailing down the river below him, Cliff sees a sheep on a ship. In a flash, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. Should you see a sheep on a ship, shout, save me. Save me! My pleasure. Are Cliffhanger's days of anguish on the cliff finally finished? I said, save me, not shave me. Oh, sorry. Shucks. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Can't hold on much longer. Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger. Today's adventure, number 493, Cliffhanger and the Soiled Oil Lamp. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Damn. Hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff notices a soiled oil lamp. 
quickly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Employing his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you see a soiled oil lamp, pick it up, rub it, and a genie will come out. I am Roy, the genie of the soiled oil lamp, and I am here to grant you one wish. Oh boy! Okay, Roy, here's my wish. Get me off this cliff! Is it time for Cliff to rejoice at last? Is he finally poised to get off this cliff? As you wished, here is your own personal copy of Off This Cliff by Boyd Hoyle. But I don't want this book. I want you to get me off this cliff. Sorry, you only get one wish, and you used it to get the book. Well, see ya. Boy. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Can't hold on much longer. Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing daring and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number 2631, Cliffhanger Comes to the Circus. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff notices that a circus has been set up below his cliff. The crafty cliffhanger reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his celebrated decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you see that a circus has been set up below your cliff, look for the trapeze artist's net and jump into it. There's the net. It's that circle there. Look out below. Here I come. Can this be it? Has Cliff finally escaped from his cliff? Oops. Ladies and gentlemen, before your very eyes, a man will be shot out of a cannon! Three, two, one, fire! Curses! And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Can't hold on much longer! Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, number 11 million and 12, Cliffhanger Sings the Blues. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff spots two music talent scouts on the lawn below his cliff. Hey, Simon. Are we lucky to be here looking for red-hot new singers, or what? Other scouts will be green with envy, Paula. Quickly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his legendary decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you spot two music talent scouts looking for red-hot new singers, let them hear you sing. Excuse me, I've got a little blues number that I'd like to perform for y'all. I've been hanging here so long that my arm is getting stiff. No, I can't hold on much longer. Please get me off this cliff. Lovely. Does that mean you'll sign me to a contract and get me off this cliff? Well, no. We liked you, but we like the people in the helicopter better. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! 
flying off the shelf once again. It's the continuing, daring, and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, book 212, Cliffhanger, The Lapdog, and The Riddle. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff, and that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff spots a father and daughter sitting at the edge of his cliff. Father, I've got a riddle to tell you. No riddles till we find you a lapdog. That's why we're here. Quickly, Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his expert decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you see a father looking for a lapdog, don't be afraid to put on a lapdog costume and go woof woof. I am not afraid. Woof woof. Father, look! Has good fortune smiled on our brave hero at last? Now this is scary! Oh. Now that you have your lapdog, you can tell me your riddle. Okay. What's the one thing you lose every time you stand up? I don't know. Tell me. Your lap! <laughs> and that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Can't hold on much longer. Flying off the shelf once again, it's the continuing, daring, and dangling adventures of Cliffhanger! Today's adventure, episode 9000, Cliffhanger, the Mole, and the Rope. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger! Excuse me! Excuse me! We find Cliffhanger where we left him last. Hanging from a cliff! Can't hold on much longer! Suddenly, Cliff notices a very large mole popping out of a hole and holding one end of a rope. Cliff gropes around in his backpack and extracts his trusty survival manual. Using his noted decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you notice a mole holding one end of a rope, ask him to throw you the other end. I hate to impose, Mr. Mole, sir, but might you please be so kind as to throw me the other end of your rope? <laughs> I shall do what you propose. Is this the moment Cliff has hoped for? Mr. Mole, sir, I want to express my gratitude for your extraordinary kindness. Oh, you're welcome. In fact, since you've enjoyed receiving the end of my rope so much, I've decided to give you the whole rope. I'm at the end of my rope. And that's why he's called Cliff Hanger. Can't hold on much longer. Cliffhanger, hanging from a cliff. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Excuse me, excuse me. Today's adventure, episode 445. Cliffhanger, the pheasant, and the phone. We find Cliffhanger where we left him last, hanging from a cliff. Can't hold on much longer. Suddenly, Cliff notices a pheasant on the cliff above him. Hello? Oh, hey, Phil. I'm on a cliff. Can you hear me? Hello? Hello? Can you hear? Yeah. Cliff reaches into his backpack and extracts his survival manual. Using his phenomenal decoding skills, Cliff begins to read. If you see a pheasant talking to his friend Phil on his cell phone, ask him if you might borrow the phone 
to call the Get Me Off This Cliff helpline. 555 Cliff. Excuse me, might I borrow your phone to call the Get Me Off This Cliff helpline? Oh, wait, I gotta go. A guy hanging from a cliff needs my phone. Sure, you can borrow my phone, but first I have to show you something very interesting. Look, the word pheasant begins with the PH f sound. Pheasant. Yeah, that's very interesting. Now, if you don't mind. I love saying it. Pheasant. Pheasant. You should try it. Pheasant. Yeah. Huh? If the pheasant asks you to say the word pheasant, say it. Oh. Pheasant! Very good! Now, how about the phone? Yes, exactly. The word phone starts with the PH f sound, too. Phone. Whoa! Uh oh. Is this it? Is Cliff going to fall from the cliff? Uh, might I have the phone now, please? Oh, 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 of course. Using his expert touch tone skills, Cliff calls the helpline number. Hello, welcome to the Get Me Off This Cliff helpline. This call may be monitored for quality assurance. If you want help getting off a cliff, please press or say one. If you want to take advantage of any of our other exciting offers, press or say two. Hmm, exciting offers? One! One! Please hold while we track your phone's location. I'm on hold. Ah, no problem. Take your time. We have pinpointed your phone's location and can get you off that cliff in less than 15 seconds. If you want to accept this offer, press or say one. If you do not... One! One! A rescue specialist will be arriving shortly. Have a nice day. Is this it? Will Cliffhanger finally be getting off the cliff? Um, may I have my phone back, please? Oh, sure. Thanks. Uh, goodbye. No, not the pheasant. Me! Fooey. And that's why he's called Cliffhanger. Can't hold on much longer.